Hey, hey guys, we are back for another video. So I'm going to jump into this video relatively quickly. Got some very interesting information. I just did a video on Benzino exposing Bambi, but y'all, she is mad at Scrappy to the point that she is now suing him. Let's let our intro play out and let's jump into this video. I don't have any time for any gossip now. Eh? Yes. Now, before we get into this video, I need to send you guys a shout out. And I want to thank you all for going to Patreon and subscribing and following me. But we are not done. I need y'all to continue to go on over there and subscribe. If you are not familiar, it's simple. Just go to Google, type in patreon.com. Once the website comes up, go to find or search for a creator and type in LaKeisha Keisha. Now let's get into this story. Well, it looks like the fighting with Bambi and Scrappy is not over, although we just saw them on this last Easter with the kids and it seemed that they were having a nice family moment. But apparently that was very short-lived, honey, because Bambi has marched him right back into court, which means she sued him, took him back to court, and she's asking for more money. And she has a complaint against him. And also she wants him to have less um, time with his own children. Yes, that is a little bit crazy, but let's get into what the documents say. Um, and this was obtained by Radar Online. So the documents read, Little Scrappy's ex-wife Bambi dragged him back to court, accusing him of violating their divorce settlement by allowing his significant other to post photos of their children on social media. Now, the significant uh, other, I believe she's referencing Erica Dixon. If you guys follow them, Erica Dixon showed the kids playing together. Whew. But any, anywho, according to court documents obtained by Radar Online, Bambi asked for a change in their current custody deal. In June 2023, both Scrappy and Bambi agreed to share joint legal custody and Bambi having primary custody of the kids with Scrappy having visitation. She accused that, um, scrappy of uh, failing to bring one of their children to school on time. Now that is pet D. I mean, being late a time or two, girl, bye. It says Bambi said it would be in the best interest of the child that the parenting time be modified to hours where Scrappy is not responsible to take the children to school. So what she's trying to do is get more child support because the less time he has with the children would mean it's more money that he would have to pay her. So it says Bambi says Scrappy pays her $4,800 per month in child support. She said there has been a material change in circumstances since the amount was entered. So now all of a sudden she wants more money because she's saying there's a change. But girl, it seemed like you may be just a little mad. I'm just saying. So Bambi argued for an increase in the child support due to the party's younger children. They will begin attending private school with the eldest minor child. Also in her lawsuit, Bambi asked that Scrappy be found in contempt for the alleged violations of their divorce agreement, which means whoever this significant other is that share pictures of her children, she wants Scrappy to be held in contempt for violation. Bambi also stated that, um, that there was a restriction in their divorce decree that stated that their intimate partners would not be able to post any of their minor children 
on any social media. Bambi also said since the final judgment and divorce decree was enter entered, that Scrappy has allowed a significant other to post their minor children on her social media page. It says Scrappy recently rekindled his romance with Erica Dixon, but you guys know, of course, Erica Dixon would not agree and she would not say that. So it seems as if Scrappy has not responded to this motion at all. So what is the real issue? They are just divorced. Their divorce decree is not even a year old. And now she's saying it's all of these changes in circumstances and you have a child going to school. I'm sure the judge knew that your child was going to school when the child was going to school. It's not like it's five years from now. Um, so she's giving very much bitter. She's giving very much mad and angry. And I believe that this is in retaliation because he is looking like he's back with Erica Dixon. And I believe she's feeling some sort of a way about it. Well, I will tell you who is not standing for the bullshit. Y'all already know Mama D. Um, and Mama D has spoken very candid about Scrappy. Um, she stated that Scrappy was very de depressed. De very depressed is what she stated. Um, and he also said that he was depressed. So I feel like Mama D is like, girl, you is not going to bring my son to depression yet again. Um, but the true issue is why, why are you taking this man back to court with these petty ass allegations. He was late. She didn't say he was late 30 times or he was late 20 times. Ma'am, you sounded like he was late one or two times. It's giving bitter baby mother, okay? And then she stated the significant other post the child on social media. Honey, that was one time. If you're talking about Erica Dixon, which I believe that you are, again, one time. And then you beg and plead with the court to basically sanction Scrappy. Then you say you need more money. Oh, girl, you looking real bad out here. But listen, y'all, y'all know Mama D was not here for it at all. Let's get into what Mama D had to say. Well, apparently Mama D has some evidence on Bambi and saying, girl, if you're not careful, I'm going to post a video that will make the whole world turn on you. I have the video, Bam. I'm not playing with you, girl. Shut it down and shut it down quick. So this is the lawsuit that she's referring to um, that she is suing Scrappy. Then she states, Mama D, furthermore, She's not even supposed to be discussing him. So she messed up already herself. So I don't know what part of the game, but that divorce decree does not stay. Does not stay? Or maybe she mean does not say. That she just keep lying and y'all keep listening. I told the world, I told the world was a lot smarter, maybe. I told the world I was a lot smarter than that. 
I myself have the court transcript and I will release them. So here we go again with this foolery, just when we saw them together on Easter. What was that, a week ago? I don't even think it's been a week ago. This is too much. As always, guys, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to my channel. Make sure you enable your bell notification so you do not miss out on a video.